nine eggs. Make sure there's no shells. Get those poured in there. Now we're gonna give these eggs a good bath. Place these in here. I'm gonna go ahead and pour, this is just plain water. Pour it at the bottom, fill it to sight. There you see, they're starting to float. That's about right. We're gonna put this in the oven at 350 for about 35 minutes. Our eggs have been in their egg bath. Ooh, look at that. So I saw this online. I love me some egg salad, but I hate boiling the eggs and then peeling them. So when I saw this recipe, I figured I would give it a try and it looks like it hasn't let me down. So that was nine eggs. We put them in their little bath. So we're just gonna cut these up. We wanna cut them up real fine. They cooked pretty awesome. I'm excited that I'm not having to peel the eggs. So get that all chopped up. So I am copying this lady's recipe as she did it as a different version of egg salad. Kind of switch it up. So I know she did the eggs real fine. Trying to get in there and get them all chopped up. My kids do not like big pieces of egg. I've learned that over the years. So we got that all chopped up. And all we did was put those eggs in the pan, put them in their little water, and set them in a little bath in the oven. We're gonna go ahead and pour these into our bowl. Egg salad is so yummy all year round. So I'm super excited to do this. We got one quarter cup red onions. quarter cup green onions. You could use chives. Quarter cup parsley. Now I did see in this recipe, we're gonna bring our cutting board back a little bit. She used pickles. I've never used pickles, but we're gonna go ahead and try these pickles out. Put these on here. I know I'm reusing the same cutting board, but it's all going in the same bowl. So she used four. We're gonna go ahead and cut these up small. Not sure how big chunks of pickles would be, so I want them nice and small. I don't know about you, but I love some pickles. Excited to taste this, add a new little twang to my egg salad recipe. Get those pickles all cut up nice and finely. Now's the time to use your knife skills. Those are all cut up. Go ahead and bring our bowl back, put our pickles in there. Every time I cut pickles, it makes me want to eat a pickle. Gonna go ahead and take our mayonnaise, Best Foods. It's my favorite mayonnaise. You want about a half cup. I'm gonna go a little more. I like mine extra creamy. So we're gonna go with about three fourths of a cup mayonnaise. Some Dijon mustard. Gonna add about mm, a table and a half by eye, maybe a little more. Some salt. Get some flavor in there. We didn't put any flavor in our eggs. And some black pepper. Now you can serve this so many different ways. My kids like it on some white bread. I cut off the crust, cut it in fours. 
have their cute little sandwiches. Put it on any type of bread that you like. Go ahead and get that all mixed in there. You want to get all the veggies all mixed in together. And I don't know, I've never had parsley in my potato salad, I mean, my egg salad neither, so I'm pretty excited to try this new recipe. It's all mixed in, looks delicious. We didn't have to wrestle with those eggs. Mmm. Got all the onions, green onions, pickles, everything's all mixed in. Everything's covered in that mayonnaise and Dijon. We're going to go ahead and give this a try. See how this recipe turned out. I'm just going to put a little bit on a plate. You could put yours on some bread. I really want to taste the recipe. So we're going to go ahead and give this a try. Here we go. That's really good. The pickles, the onion, the egg. That was fast. That was easy. And it's delicious. Try this out.